down for me. <laughs> Good morning guys and welcome back. Well I'm here in Saxakali with my friend Mike and Kimo Paul the famous cricketer and I'm here to spend the weekend we have come out here to do a bit of hunting sightseeing and fishing so let's go out and have some fun and please don't forget to subscribe to the channel all right then you guys seeing this here this is a colony of yellow rump or red rum cassie well they're out probably when they come back in this afternoon i will show you guys what they look like it's a mm -hmm. bright yellow and blackboard they're coming across guyana you would find them like this here most of the time a whole group of them a lot of nests they're just making a lot of noise probably when they come around this afternoon i will give you guys a view of them it looks like this guy here rounding up some bait so I want you guys have a look at the kind of bait this guy is getting. Let's go and check it out. Them boss, so he's trying to water and so forth. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, there's um, see a hole on the seed, is all there's no inside, it's got a worm. Yeah, oh, okay, got a waited time, a certain time, like then. All right, see the hole on it, mm -hmm. fight now. Mm -hmm. Let's get fish, but I don't know. It's like, all right, guys, where you see this here, this is the cockroach seed, he's borsing. Normally, you see it with a small air hole, this is how you know them, in, them the worm is inside, so. We're using this as bait to catch fish. Bucket to see. Alright. So we're going out on the river and try and see what bait fish we can get and then we're gonna use them to see if we can get some bigger catfish. Alright guys, so we're going out and see if we catch two fish now. Watercolor looking bad, boy. The watercolor looking bad. Yeah, when we go in the quick boat, you can get clean water. What? Come, come, we got a rock. Call me in the water. Waterfall boat stick up. We just came off a creek on the main river, not too far from where we were staying. But now we are at a old gold mining road, and we are walking in that direction. They are going to a creek, so let me go and check out and see the techniques these guys using to catch fish. They are saying it's a really long walk, so let me keep up. Well, them guys keep saying the face is right down there. We walking and we ain't reaching. I'm a water almost finish. Anyway, once you start seeing fish and get the energy to come back out, at least guys is cutting a 
vine they call in Hyrie. They said we're gonna try that and see what we're gonna get. Let's go and check them out and see what they're cutting. Where's dude? Make the fish them get drunk? Tell him I'm not the vine name. Hyrie. Hyrie? Yeah. Mm. So what you, what you do? You know, um, what can I get you for the fish there? Yeah. Like fat, the tongue. And it's a bit of the noise, get, it's give a white milk. Okay. You got soap in the water. You just drunk the fish. Yeah. Nice. Right. Let's see one of the fish. Ah, uh, let's see if we got going. Mm -hmm. What? We're gonna make it better this dip. Yeah, we're gonna <laughs> make it better. I like we're gonna make it. Watch up, watch up the fine one. Chop the one and it's going to go. No, no. Good piece of fetching we got here. I hear about this before, but I never see anybody do it. Well, today I can see what's going on. What the hairy? Yeah. Now I'm fighting this fish now, years now. Oh. Well, today I can see how it's working. Yeah, next thing is you, a leaf. A leaf. Then Konami. Konami. Yeah, well, that, that, I know about this one here. I never hear about the leaf. See, see the leaf, one walk. That be dope. Look. Mash it up to like in a hole, like. Oh. In a hole. Mm. And pong you up the quick time. Throw the ball in the water. Fish. No, what about you? Go there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice load for fish. Right straight to the creek. They call it bush rope. Or nibi. Nibi. Yeah. Nibi. I hope you're well. Meet and roll out here. Yeah. Make a bark for your bark there. All right, guys, are you running to a small swamp there? Trust me, this whole stretch here is swamp and they got some guys walking with slippers, so we gotta take the time and come through. Look at my boots condition. This is swamp. The direction we are in. I'll be too slippery, man. Kimo and Mike. <laughs> Let's take a your time. Far more quick, guys. Oh. Guys, so we need a farm. Oh. Take me time and go. <laughs> yeah, four wheel drive. Got walk. I got on four wheel. What skill? Come, Mike. Let me see you. <laughs> nice. Anyway, you only good over. Oh, we don't charge you know that. Yeah. You're only half an hour in this um, swamp here. Half hour in the only, swamp? No, yeah, same. You got half an hour more for go. <laughs> this is the master? Yeah, this is the master. Nah, you ain't got far more. This is the master, me. Not far ago. <laughs> but you know when the master right down there, you don't know where you got to walk a little distance. Alright, do we go down? I believe there's a secret fishing spot. Even the fishing even know about it. <laughs> I believe well, there's our secret is secret. Don't worry, look at Queen, get a good catch. Fish, 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 yeah, fish a blue. I never walked so far yet to get a fish. <laughs> fish a manga blue. Fresh quick water. All right, guys. That we, what they're doing there is this. I something like a. They use it like a, like a, like a hammer to beat that same thing that we cut to soften it to get a, the the sap out of it. So when they put that in the water, that would make the fish drunk like they say and they would float up and they would collect as much nice as they could time. catch bundle from bundle how much are you walking? how long are you walking? about two hours? three bundles will slow me up <laughs> 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 yeah, the man is going to pull up the bundle now 
I look sick, man. Like you know what you're doing. Yeah, man. This is already. Did it before. Anyway, I look. I hear about it, but I never see anybody do it. You hey, see, Mike? You just gotta fetch it. You gotta pong them too. <laughs> pressure, pal. <button>, pressure. <laughs> <laughs> You don't tire it to all and then when done you gotta come on, pong it. This is not the problem. When all the fish float up, you gotta fetch it out to eat. <laughs> this is the problem there. You want you know, don't far there. Yeah man, but you don't let them trust me, you're gonna fetch them out. Characters, this is what we're looking for. But wait, you don't understand how we calculate it. You have to tell me when you are left, so we coming for your bait. If this is for get beat, part, no man. <laughs> this, yeah. Alice, oh, you got to just get the beat. Then go and catch the fish. Where we go, though? You worry, this same beat is still going to turn thinner than I don't see style. You have to rub some of my foot, they get in them. Go on in. I see it, I do. I'm going to say the guy got the water more key to activate. The sap inside the vine to get to drum the fish, and that's how they're doing it. Learning experience, Mike. Never too big for learn. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I said the bundle of vine that everybody was catching. One of them guys show away they want too much of weight. The distance. All this work for little fish. Good experience though. The rope that they used to catch it, tell you in the forest have everything. Just gotta know how to find it. You go there? Alright, so cop. You trust me to have a really high sense to it. Yeah, that man got eye floaty. Be there. The nice size won't get to be there, boy. You get it? Oh. Get the A nice size one. At one point, I think it was an eel. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Good. yeah. This logo, you logo. all are eel and put it in you. You're looking good. It's a nice big logo. logo. Alright, all right, Michael. This is the one you're carrying low, low with tonight. Smart. Alright. It's time we start picking them up. Huh? Nice, nice. Alright, guys, we're late. Already beat out the stuff. They don't let it down the creek. So. Now we're just walking down the creek and see what we're going to pick up. Trust me, this water is really, really cold.
Now you just gotta look and see who's floating up. We got some monkey passing through. This is a wedge cap. Wedge cap or brown capuchin. I ain't seen them clearly. Yeah. Are we still searching? Yeah, I already picked up a few so far. Never did so much work for bait yet. You see one eh? Huh? Eh? A small one? Mm. Be a hard thing. Oh you gone. The monkey. The monkey like the one come down. What you going on up there? Set a monkey. I I she got one here float up. Watch we got one here float up. The monkey, the monkey you wanna shy with me yet, but I got a, a, a little a nice bait here float up. <coughs> You gonna see what's going on in this bucket. How oh, the bucket look in there, my good? How do you see? Sell a bit. <laughs> what? Yeah, more logo logo. And a big pot for this one. This is what a catfish, oh. What? Uh, Classy. Alright, nice little start. Never worked so hard for bait yet, Mike. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All this in the fall. Yeah, sit down here and the man just floated up coming to me. Yes, man, hi, Maro. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but you look none like a hurry. Hi. So we get in there, we get in them. We got this hi, Maro here. We get our next logo logo. This car, see, right? Car, mm -hmm. see? And we got another big logo logo up top here. I don't want to show you. Aye. Not a big logo logo. Yeah, nice to start here, man. Nice. Alright, guys. Well, the place is getting dark and it's a long way out of here. And trust me, we're still picking up a few fish. Well, them guys done walk and gone all the way down the line picking up and, and I'm still seeing a few while I'm behind look I just got a beautiful sunfish here and look they have one more along the water edge here look that's how they're turning up like this well all these here we will be using for bait tonight them guys said they have some catfish just be out there. So we can go and put on some rod and see what we can pick up tonight. Well, the main thing right now is getting out of here. Trust me, this was a new experience for me. Well, them guys said they don't do this much often. It's been a couple of years now since they went here. They just bring us out to have fun this weekend and then we'll be heading back home tomorrow. I got the cold, cold bike. <coughs> See, they're ready, they're ready, they're ready. Where are you pushing on, holy? You see they're bubbling up there all the time, a nice size of Imaro. Gun? You went right there, man. Monster get away. Oh, you get it? Will you please see there? That was kind <laughs> Ah, that's up, that's up. Still get away. Yeah, you see? 
<laughs> ah, you want you want it? Are you there right there? Ah, I get three again. You got choppy. He just let me in. Move like that. What size? Yeah, this one. This we be looking for. This size we looking for. Hey, come, come, <laughs> come. Don't get three. How this go wrong? Is we looking for monster? I see you getting them. I show you all. I see this bike. Where? Big one? Yeah, you have to float in right there. Chop me. You get one there? Troy, Troy, Troy. Action. This one is. Bigger one, that one. Bigger one. Are they, are they, are they, are they? Right there, right there. Yeti? What? Now you get it. Come on, get it. This is a mess. Thailand, that's a big one. Are you telling me? Yeah. Lower would walk by once we didn't drunk them. We need to catch them with lower. We need to catch them, boy. Huh? There's a monster. Yeah, yeah. How we feel like we're doing something. What about another one? Another one. This too much size. Big for here, boy. There's a monster, boy. This one is size. This one is even more bigger. Aye. Hmm. Can I watch you come up there? Watch it, watch it. Come, come, go back up there, go back up there, go back up there. Nice size one. All right, guys, trust me, this trip was worth it. I think we can call it an afternoon because it's a long way back out. We had some really nice size. Eye. We didn't have to go too far for them. We got this one here. We had to go what? We had to go too far for them. We walk far for Richard, <laughs> but we had to travel far for Kami. <laughs> we got we bought it a bit for tonight. Moss. <laughs> this is not far, but you know far from this guy go for these fish. And we got these setting. This is a really nice big one. So we can call it afternoon. We can it's a long walk back out of this bush. Like this guy saying in the background here, because everybody is really tired. And we can grab something to eat and then we can come out back on the river and see what more we're gonna catch. Tonight. Tonight. With this man here, so anything me. possible with this man here. This man here don't play. This man said, buy me and get at least two harbor for you. He said, all right. So <laughs> <laughs> fetching the wood just now was the whole location. Now we'll oh. fetch this here back out. It's another problem. Imagine we get 10 of the apart now. Ooh, we'll fetch the out. The lo oh. the 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 Imaraga bobo eight. eight pong nine pong but the big one eh? eight. yeah eight, eight pong ten. right imagine ten of the friend hmm. who fetching though <laughs> I I could hardly fetch myself muscles for fetch the one whole head come off mm. you can't think but put this one on you can't go on the stick all we'll of the go. stick let me see them all we'll of the stick I put it in the bucket yeah the little one there the one <laughs> I hold on I come in yeah. Alright guys, well today is our second day in Saksakali village. Well the meaning of that word is Kingfisher. For some of you guys who don't know where this place is, it's on the right bank of the Escriba River when coming from Porico. Well we took about 25 minutes to half an hour to get here with the boat that we came with. Some people would even come faster or slower. But let's go and check out the village and see what it looks like. Please windy and nice today have a seven days adventist charge there they have a lot of mango tree out here nice sandy beach well this is the escriba river from the head to the mouth it's the only sand you can find 
Nice and clean one. Mango in season. Did you see how much more mango is in the village? I can just tell you, this place got a lot of mango tree. And this guy climbing and go up for some. Oh, and I forget to tell you guys one thing. Well, we did went out last night and we took a serious blow. Trust me, we didn't catch any fish. We only saw one lava and we didn't get it. Them guys missed it. And we saw a lot of spectacle came on. And them guys taking a little drink there. We're gonna come back and join them just now before we head back to Puerto Rico. So, this is the continuation of the village. Them guys got a small cricket gong ground there. But it's got to have a cricket gong here because the guy Kimo Paul, he's from this village. That's the guy that I came up with and he's a cricketer for Guyana. That's the guy that play in the CPL and won. Well yesterday was a really long walk and last night we was out on the water top till about 3 30 this morning we get back in so i'm really tired all of my body is paining me because of that walk it's a long time i didn't do a walk like that they was just shouting me to come through this track here and check out this point here this place is really really nice and clean quiet and calm nice place to be let's go and check out the river in front here look at this view guys look at this view this is a really high elevation well all the way in that direction is going to Bartico nice view man Alright then, so let me head back more in the village in the direction and check out some other places. Nice shot, boy. I dropped the catch. Alright, guys, well, this is the other part of the village. This is Saxakali Primary and Nursery School. We have the information and communication technology hub there, and we have the health post. Well, they have more. Uh, more people living along the road going down that side but I ain't able to walk too far trust me my foot is really paining me from that walk yesterday so this is what the place is like we have the road continuing going all the way down to where we came from and the house is probably like a corner away from each other or even more farther so it's a far walk for me to show you guys more and I hope you guys enjoying the short view of the village. So let me go back and join these guys. Make one little spin, come back. Place tidal water is up. We got swim for we both now. We see y'all. Mikey Mopa bring me out on a nice adventure man. Big man Mike at the back there. Y'all ain't had enough work to do there, boy. I want to see how y'all can loose it out. Place nice, man. People come out swimming. Nice time. Well, I hope you guys enjoy every bit of this here. Please don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks for joining me on this one. I'll see you guys in the next video. Big up to you by Kimo. Big up to you by Mike. Mike592. And trust me, 
we're coming back definitely and join these guys to do some fishing with them but that's gonna that's going to happen in the rainy season because them guys say when the water when the rain fall and the water raise up it get more clean and a lot of basher come a lot of basher just come out in front here so see you guys on the next adventure